Okay, guys, I don't know if you can see that right. About there. There's a duck right there and a duck right there. It's sitting down. Not that white one, the brown one right there. Those two ducks I showed you, the one with the green head, and the white one. Oh, now mine's chasing it. Haha, <laughs> it's funny. Those are two wild ducks. So, they just showed up. This video, we may live with the log stuff. I don't know. Oh, there they go. Ooh, chasing. Tutorial stuff. And she right there is a male. Oh, that's a female. <laughs> And then the one right there, the brown one, is a female. And those two are both males. They're little. So, we're gonna see what kind of video we can make this right here. And, I don't know, we'll see what we can do, because this is all uh, kind of weird. They were here last spring. They come like every morning, like 6.15, 6.30. And they'd swim in our pool. Oh, there they go again. Oh, down to the yard. Oh, now I can't see it now. But anyways, that one's just up there chilling. It'd be kind of cool if they just like flew in my fence and I kind of stayed here. Oh, there it goes. Fly, oh, fly, Johnny. It flew up the hill. I can't catch them because it's kind of illegal. If they fly into my fence and they stay there, I can't really control that. I mean, I don't know how you judge that in court and stuff, but it's cool. So, there they are right there. We're gonna see what we can do with them. So, let's go ahead and um, get right into this video. We're gonna have two minutes in. So, you guys saw those ducks, but now we're heading back into this field. And I used to see like 20, 25 deep here in the evening. And... I do know there's some bucks back here, and I'm gonna go look for the sheds, but I also do know there's coyotes, so I brought my 22. Never tried shooting a coyote 22, but uh, if we see one, definitely gonna shoot it. So as you guys can see here, this is a big old field, real big. I'm um, definitely not gonna be able to cover it all today, because I have to go home and take a shower and stuff, but I'm not gonna be able to cover it. I have like... Eh, maybe 20 to 30 minutes, maybe 40 minutes to look at this and see if we can cover. We're gonna cover this left side or the part of this left side. So if you guys can see there, the hill goes up and it goes down. That's only like a third of the way. So we got a lot to do here. So let's get to it. Well, fellas, uh, get to find anything. I did shoot out of ground. Uh oh, it's pretty far. I missed it. Like probably about a 75 yard shot. That's with our, my iron sights, so it's a little rough. Uh, I'd come out tonight and try to roost a turkey, a gobbler, just for the heck of it. But it's so late in the season. It's May 25th, and it's too late that they don't want to gobble anymore. But we uh. I don't know, actually what I'm gonna say, to be honest. But the turkeys, I mean, our Pennsylvania season, man, it's just too late. It begins like last Saturday of April, and people around us, like West Virginia, they're starting like end of March. So, it's just rough. But we still yet to find a shed. So, uh, I do know some more spots. Um, around here but then like other places like typical general other places I definitely want to look at for sure but uh, until then well I don't know we're probably gonna add something else to this video but we will so I'll talk to you guys then okay fellas so uh, we have been having a little problem here we've been losing chickens to a raccoon for a very long time for like, not a very long time, like a week and a half, but that's still way too long. They've been, I've probably lost anywhere from 15 to 20 chickens. So, 
I know these, I can't really show you that one. Uh, so, I could kind of, how do I say it? It's dead. I don't want to show you. It'll go against me, my YouTube violation thingy. But, I do have a dog proof trap that I am going to set. I can't do it tonight because I don't have it. I'll have it tomorrow. But, that's definitely the point is to try and set it. So, I don't know. It's just been a little rough. They've, but, let's go ahead and put this camera card in. Put it in right over here. I've been filming on my phone lately. Um, actually, I don't know why I'm going to put, I'm just gonna, not going to turn this camera on until later. The chickens that get out are just going to fill it up with all kinds of pictures. But, I'm curious to know where they're getting in. I'm curious how many chickens I have left, too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fifteen chickens, maybe. So I probably lost 15 to 17 chickens. 15 to 20. A reasonable number. No, I mean, not reasonable to me, but it kind of sucks. I, I, I'm just trying to make this like, video like a vlog. I don't know, just, I don't know how it's going to work out. Eh, we have two more chickens in here. I lost one last night, so that kind of sucks. I think I lost one of my favorite chickens. I like it. That chicken I didn't think it is. I'm pretty disappointed. I think I have like two chickens from the beginning and left. Possibly three. That's kind of disappointing. Huh. Dang. That is one of my chickens. My favorite chicken. Shh. I got, they're getting all riled up. Because they heard the word favorite and it wasn't them. <laughs> oh well. So we're gonna come out tomorrow. We're definitely gonna put the doll proof trap on. Might be a different video. I'm not quite sure. So if in case it's not, uh, I guess I'll check you guys on when we see that or whatever that is. But make sure you pick up some merch, please. Uh, help me out. So. Catch you guys later.